get to the flats. It's just the life that we live. Oh, yeah. Half full of half empty. Half full or half empty, hearts full, it ain't empty. Pull up with love, no envy. Pull up with ends in a Bentley. Don't need them to accept me, but you are gonna respect me. I got a beast in my belly, don't tempt me. Burn the belly of the beast, is deadly. Half full or half empty, hearts full, it ain't empty. Pull up with love, no envy. Kenzo, Fendi, no Mackenzie. Don't need them to accept me, but you are gonna respect me. I got a beast in my belly, don't tempt me. Burn the belly of the beast, is deadly. What the they started this ain't your average artist yeah i grew up on heartless but i never been half-hearted it don't depend who's asking suck what it couldn't be me you're speaking me? these men didn't believe in you now they want to chill with you this comes to me naturally this ain't no gimmick or act to me nah. me that's like there's a lot another award that i love that they brought back is the bass point the extra bass point is amazing because it just makes your bill so different from other bills and it makes you unique and then of course come on now the tiger i can't believe that the tiger is back on nba 2k i used to dream in 2k 16 seeing legends walk around with a tiger and now i'm able to get one myself I mean, this is just a W season that 2K has brought out. So one thing that's really cool about your journey is you're hitting level 40 on current gen and last gen. What are some tips that you can give players that are looking to hit level 40 on either or? Yes, definitely. You know, use the 2X um, P coins. They definitely... Welcome everyone to this 2K Sports Broadcast live from the capital city of California, Sacramento. And here it comes, the NBA on 2K Sports. With Greg Anthony and Brett Berry, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll be hearing from David Aldridge on the sideline. It's a one-game reprieve at home for the Kings here with their Sacramento fans and then back on the road. Well, guys, at this point, while still many things can change, the record is not on par with their performance last year. Maybe a cause for concern, but something they are well aware of. And checking out Sacramento, they've shown me some very good things this season. But that next step, those qualities that could make them true contenders, just haven't been there. Now, you just don't want to sit in the middle for too long. You either want to be competing against the top teams or starting to strategize where you can position yourself for a high lottery pick and maybe turn around your franchise's fortunes. Now the starting group for the visitors. Joe Harris is out there with smooth. And it's LeBron James. Then there's Stephen Kirk. And it's Young in at the two-guard spot. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. And making a statement right away. Letting them know they won't get any easy ones when he's around. And for teams already exceeding expectations, Greg, their spirits are running sky high right now. And it's such a great feeling to come out strong, but it's hard to maintain that consistency. The teams that do, they believe in themselves and they keep playing to their strength. Halliburton on the wing. Here's Thompson, and Thompson throws it down. Thompson. Just to Thompson with some force on that one. Earlier, David Aldridge had a chance to speak with head coach Alvin Gentry. D.A., what did you find out? Well, Kevin, he gave me some broad strokes regarding the game plan. He said we want to work the ball into the paint, high percentage looks, and then get to the foul line if we can. We'll see how they try to accomplish that throughout the game. Kevin? All right, thank you, David. And Jim gets the whistle that time. First team foul. That's his first foul. So it's Sacramento off the inbound pass. And there's the nice layup by Fox. Fox has got his second basket. Thompson with a nice job finding the open man, creating for his teammate. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And it's Young that time on the assist by Kerr. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rack and, and where's the help defensively yeah APB sent out to try to find out where the defense is inexcusable and 
credit the screen for giving him the space he needed to get to the rim. For sure, GA allows him to come in with the sledgehammer. Yeah, well, he you settle for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that? Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. No great thinking about De'Aaron Fox and what's Seven next for him. Three. We know how much he wants that's to get to the playoffs and contend. Yeah, I mean, Fox doesn't just want to have impressive regular seasons. This guy, his goal is to get his squad to the postseason. And not only that, he wants a chance to win titles. So much talk about who's the fastest player in the league. And yeah, Fox always being mentioned there. His speed and stepping into this leadership role. Lots of great signs from De'Aaron Fox. Here's Curry. There is it from about 10 Stephen feet away. Curry. Just feels like there's not a spot on the floor where Steph Curry does not have great touch. And it's Fox with the ball for Sacramento. Down low, Thompson. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. Defensive and a nice job here LeBron early James. of establishing That's an inside presence. Foul. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown Shooting for the Kings. You've got to like the Tristan. consistency with which they're hitting that mid-range jump. I'm loving the ping-pong action of the ball tonight. A decent number of assists so far. Curry passes to Smooth. And the shot is good. Yeah, how about the court Assistant awareness there? Peripheral vision Stephen of Curry. Curry. Strong feel for when guys are uncovered. Finds the open man. Now, here's Fox. He's got eight. Now about three minutes gone in the first quarter. Off target with his three. Looks like the game plan is they're willing to give him that kind of shot. It worked out for them this time, but... They give it to him again. I, I bet three points are coming. Here's Young. Tristan Thompson picking up that last bucket. Smooth passes to Young. Fox with the steal. Inside. And it's Barnes snapping it down. Yeah, Barnes making that dunk look really easy. Curry with it. Halliburton picks him up. Oh, and that dunk by Young. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Kings leading now by five. Fox passes to Halliburton. Back to Fox. Barnes trying to free himself up. Fox, no good. Young looking it over. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's going to go on De'Aaron Fox. That's good from Young. Rashawn Holmes, he's checked in for Sacramento. Buddy Heald comes in for Harrison Barnes. And so he hits both. Well, when he gets into a groove at the free throw line, it doesn't just last for tonight. This might be two weeks, two months, something like that. Now here's Holmes. And Holmes throws it down. More and more improved floor awareness for De'Aaron Fox. De'Aaron Fox. And Thompson sends it back. Yep, that one goes. 143 left to play here in the first. Halliburton on the wing. Fox goes in. That falls. Nice feed that time from Halliburton. The assist. Halliburton's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Here's LeBron, an easy two points LeBron on the lane. James. Just again, LeBron James, his size, his speed, just impossible to stop. So, hack away. The wide open look here for Fox. Offline with his three. Takes it inside, takes it up with both hands and rips it down. So far, both teams scorching the nets. You gotta love it. Yeah, made for TV game here. Pace is great. Scoring is coming in bunches. And both of the teams feeling confident right now. Now, here's Thompson. Seven points in the game. Back to Fox. He scores his fifth field goal. He's taken nine shots to get those five. Continuing to expand his offensive game. Fox off to a good start. On its way from Young for two. And he gets it to go. Hitting off the back of the rim. Young's got 12 in the game. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. Yeah, and the coach pretty smart for zoning in on him and giving him opportunities to stay with that confident play. 
And that's exactly what he's looking for, draining the triple. Here's Young. That ball is good for another field goal. His sixth. He is six for nine on the stat sheet. And he's clearly led the way offensively. The question is, can they ride him and get back into it? Now, here's Fox. 12 points for him. 11 seconds left in the first. Six to shoot. Shoots the three. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. A big-time effort for De'Aaron Fox, providing a lot of energy for the Sacramento Kings. That quarter had to take a lot out of him. He racked up 12 points. We'll return shortly. And it's been a pretty even game here after one quarter of play. And when you consider how the Kings are doing, guys, what are your thoughts? Well, the coaches preach ball movement, and, and we saw exactly why in that first quarter. Well, everybody just feeling the energy of the basketball as they moved it around, and lots of hands were touching it. It got smooth. Young is out there with Curry. And it's LeBron James. Curry. And it's Harris in at the small forward spot. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Well, gravity is very, very real, and Steph Curry has the most of any NBA player right now. He just takes advantage of the D in a way that very few players playing today can do. Now, here's Curry to the paint. Here's Smooth. LeBron trying to free himself up. And here's Halliburton. Passes to Fox. Holmes trying to free himself up. Off with the layup. Brent, when you talk about the gravity of Curry, explain what you mean. Well, Kevin, anytime that he's on the floor, three. when he crosses half court, all five defenders are paying attention to where Steph is. The more he moves, the more he shifts around the incredible attention of all five defenders. And when guys make one misstep, or you have two defenders make one misstep to carry their way to where Steph Curry is, it opens up easier opportunities on any possession. That's what we're talking about when we speak on Steph's gravity. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. The Kings currently have the league's longest playoff drought. De'Aaron Fox was eight years old the last time they made the postseason. He says this is the most passionate fan base. So let's be special and dig out of this hole. As competitors, we want to win right now. But we know that we're building something. Kevin? Well, they've got the right attitude and close to a breakthrough, many people think. David, thanks. Madhu, he's checked in for the Kings. Terrence Davis comes in for Halliburton. They are just killing him on the interior. To the middle, here's Fox. And that one falls, coming off of Davis's speed. Fox has got 14. Well, Fox, not a jump shooter, just doing a great job of mixing it up offensively now. Here's Smooth. Makes it off the glass. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Davis, the pass to Holmes. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Fox can't cash in on the 10-foot jumper. It's Young on the wing. Overhealed. Young's shot is off. To the inside. That's good from Fox on the assist by Heal. 16 points for De'Aaron Fox. Greg, you've got a unique view of the league, not just a former player, but great broadcaster, courtside all these games, but also as a father. What's that journey been like? It's been surreal, Kevin. You know, anytime you have a child that has a passion for something you're passionate about, it creates a, a special bond. And Number 23. To be able to watch him live out his journey has been incredible, and what a blessing. Uh, I would wish we'd all get to have that experience in some capacity. Now, here's Fox. He's got 16. Things are going south right now. This is not the type of shooting that his teammates expect from him. Young's shot is off. And Sacramento has possession. Here's Davis. Score the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. 
and they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Here's Young, and Young slams it home. And talk about putting some extra on it. That dunk was way over the top. Close game or not, he's going to finish firm when he gets the space. And now another look at that mobile one-block defensive performance. And in a close game, blocks like that are so close. Oh, and that could be a real That's difference maker great. here tonight. Front one alone so about Deer and Fox. He just five. seems to improve every season, which is a testament games. to his strong work ethic. No doubt, Kevin. And they always say Taking speed kills. Shots. So what I like about De'Aaron Fox is that he's learning how to be crafty with his speed. One of the quickest guys in the league and tough to stay with, but uh, he's drawing fouls. Two, three, 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 three. Uh, sometimes LeBron just LeBron likes to James. take it all out on the rim. That time on display. We've got 155 left now here on the second. Davis kicks to Holmes, and James picks up the foul. LeBron That'll be his second foul of the game. That's his and that's foul number foul. two. And second it, maybe you foul. don't sit him at this point, but you really have to be careful to not pick up another before him. Fox against Kirk. Fox goes in 13 feet away. And he connects with the jumper. Fox has got eight points here in this quarter. Pretty good. The dribble set that up, got some space, and then knocked it down. Here's Curry. It falls for the sixth time in seven tries this contest. That's 86%. And the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. Now a timeout called by Sacramento. And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Marvin Bagley's checked in for Metsu. Here's Holmes. to the paint. Good and a nice assist from Fox. And that's now six points for Rashawn Holmes. Curry passes to Smooth. From ten feet out. Not going to go that time. And so it's Davis bring the ball up for the King. They defeated Charlotte in their last game. Well, you look at the points they produced in that game. Great adjustments on the offensive end. They yeah, never stopped working. One of those games where just everybody was making shots, continual flow, and a very professional win. Halliburton's checked in for Sacramento. Here's Holmes, and Holmes throws it down. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Young against Barnes. Fires top of the key. Young's shot is good. Young's got 21 in the game. And I really feel like he just wanted us to see that leaner there. That's a shot he's very comfortable with. Fox with it. Picked up by Harris. And he gets it back. And Fox gets it to go. Yeah, that's the third bucket in a row from the paint. This defense needs to clog those lanes in the middle. LeBron's LeBron shot is good. What a determined move by LeBron. Getting to his finish even with the defender right on him. Curry against Fox. Nobody near Barnes. And the call will be against Marvin Bagley. That is his first foul of the game. I love the unselfishness, and you know coaches do as well. Well, not just coach, but you can see it in the teammates, the way that they look at him, they appreciate it when he shares the ball like that. And the teams are going to have to wait before heading to the locker room. They're going to bring out the monitor and see if he got that shot off in time. And even though... You know, you're thinking maybe we don't need the replay in a situation like this. Still plenty of time left in this game, and really it's about getting the call right. A 
Now they're going to switch the call. There is no doubt from looking at the replay that he got it off in time. Well, it's good they decided to take another look at it. I know some folks don't like how replay slows the game down and interrupts the flow, but when you have it there, you got to use it. A big-time effort for De'Aaron Fox, providing a lot of energy for the Sacramento Kings. And of everything he's doing well, it's his scoring that you point to first. Already 22 points in this game. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Steph, what do you think of your defense in the first half? We're a, little, we're a step late, I think. And, you know, they made tough shots. We can't take away from that. But uh, for the most part, we have to find a way to, to guard that line if they're knocking down shots to, uh, to keep them out of the game. We'll see where the adjustments take you. Thanks, Steph. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. And we'll be right back after halftime to start the third quarter. See you in just a bit. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. A tremendous start for De'Aaron Fox. He ended up with 22 points, five assists, and one rebound. Taking a look at the Kings, Kenny, what'd you think? We have to recognize their bench play. Sometimes we overlook the second unit, but tonight they've been the key. The coaching staff has got to be loving this, getting that extra boost. Shaq, let's get your insight on the visiting team. They were really efficient, great approach offensively. Their shot selection was first rate. They were always working hard to get good looks. That can't change in the second half. They need to be just as well organized as they have been so far. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. What a game we're seeing from Champ. Yeah, it's been a great performance from him. Really staying focused on quality shots. Yeah, this is showing that they're not going to play at anybody else's pace but their own. Now we've got a moment left on the floor. Brought to you by Gatorade All Fueled Up for the second half. On the court right now for the Kings. Fox in the backcourt with Halliburton to his son. Bagley and Holmes sharing the post duty. And it's Barnes in at the three slots. Oh, Bagley punishing the defense that time. On its way from Young for two, and misses it off the right side of the rim. Kings leading now by three. And when Sacramento took Tyrese Halliburton 12th overall in the 2020 draft, they expected him to contribute right away. And Tyrese Game delivered with an NBA Rookie of the Month in his Tristan first two months Thompson. in the league. And the Kings making a change here. Thompson's checked in. Loud pass to Bagley. Here's Curry. Young for three. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Young's got 26. Such a calming influence on the floor. Halliburton plays Greg way older than his age. And, and remember, Halliburton spent two years in college. Most of the time, we see one and done guys. But that second year can do wonders for your career. I stayed for the full four years, and that extra experience went a long way. Yeah, he, there was definitely some contact there on the three points. First, first team foul. That free throw good from Young. For the away team. Three shots. Good on the second free throw. And he nails the third. Makes it pretty tough on the defense. Who are you going to pick to send to the free throw line? I mean, he's hitting the free throws right now. Form looks good. And Smooth is going to pick up the foul. That's foul number two for him. I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. On defense, the visitors. They trail by one. Bagley in the post. And the layup is good. Bagley's got eight points. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Young, no good. 
And it's Barnes with the ball for the Sacramento Kings. Fox with it. He's picked up by LeBron. And James picks up the foul. That's his third foul of the game. Second team foul. Bagley finds Fox. Here's Barnes. Bagley trying to free himself up. That's good from Barnes on the assist by Fox. Fox has got his sixth assist on the night. Outside for Curry. On its way from Young for two. And that's good for two. Young's got 31. He makes it look effortless out there. Until the defense actually presents a challenge for him, expect those kind of results. Halliburton outside. Now the pass to Thompson. Into the lane. Good work there as it goes. He's got nine. Now Tristan Thompson, with defense around him, still gets the job done. LeBron passes to Smooth. Good, and the Number assist goes three. to LeBron. LeBron's got three assists now in this one. And guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. As a big, once you get position inside, it allows you to fight and come away with a lot of tough boards. Curry passes to LeBron. Over Thompson, and good. Stephen that thing Curry. was that time as it falls. And now just a one-point Kings lead. Here's Sacramento. Fox with it. And two points for him. And James pulls it down. Even if you're not shooting it, you like to see the effort level. And his tonight has been high. Young's shot is off. Young's gone just two of seven from long range. Halliburton passes to Fox. Let's it go from 11. Bucket is good. Fox has got 24 points. And Fox just found a little bit of space there, and he burned the defense. On its way from Young for two. Barnes grabs the miss. Sacramento leading by three. Here's Fox. The rebound by Young. Two minutes for Young's got his third. fifth rebound right now in the game. Harris passes to Smooth. It drops. That's his ninth field goal of the contest. A blistering hot nine for 11. Love his shot selection. Good at taking quality shots. Whether he's defended or open, he knows how to knock those down. And Thompson throws it down. That's a pretty easy opportunity for a teammate, all courtesy of Harrison Barnes. Curry picks to Young. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Great communication on the alley -oop. And now a five-point Kings lead. Oh, what a pass. And then he lays it in with the circus move. Mm, so smooth. Curry passes to smooth. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. And that's now 20 points for Smooth. Pass to Thompson. He dishes it to Fox. Gets the bucket and the foul. They get Stephen Curry. How about De'Aaron Fox just staying focused there with the finish? Controlled that one well. Some changes for Sacramento. Rashawn Holmes, he's checked in for Tristan Thompson. And it's Buddy Heald in for Barnes. Feeds it to Young. And Young with the stuff. Beautiful reverse jam right there. Use the rim to protect the ball, I think. 43 seconds left in the third. Fox feeling it out a bit. Here's Bagley. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. Pretty easy right now. Clear out. Give him some space. Let him get to work. Mitchell, he's checked in for Fox. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Team foul. Shooting for Sacramento. Marvin Bagley. That's good from Bagley. Now think about this. Marvin Bagley is on a high school team. But you add to that the 2018 first overall pick in DeAndre Ayton. Can you imagine being 16 and stepping onto a gym floor with those two guys? The plan of attack is obvious. Get the ball inside and go strong to the rim. 
Mitchell passes to Heald. And there's the drive. Here's Bagley. They kick out to Heal. Tries again. And that one drops. Heald's got the lead up to 7 now for the King. And you love how Heald is always ready with his feet set. Once the ball hits his hands, it's off. Leaping ability is off the charts. Not the biggest power for it, but outstanding. Rising up off the ground. And offensively, a great show for the fans through the first three quarters. It's been a fun game to watch. And let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game. And he, he may not be known as a pass-first guy playing out of the two-guard spot, but he shows here that he can dole out an assist or two when he needs to. Even though the position is called shooting guard, passing part of your responsibilities in today's game. Away team foul. We've reached the fourth quarter, and what has been a very competitive game should be an exciting finish. LeBron James is out there with smooth. Then there's Harris, and it's Young, and it's Curry in at the point. Holmes finds Halliburton. Mitchell outside. Drives to the hoop, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Mitchell's got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for Sacramento. Here's LeBron, and he hammers that one down right in the face of Rashawn Holmes. LeBron exploiting the defense once again, knowing when to slash and gets himself to the rim. A tremendous mobile one block that we had to see again. Great send back. And guys, they'll think twice about attempting that shot again. That was a big time rejection. Healed outside. Mitchell against Kirk. Mitchell kicks to home. Five to shoot. That's a two from Heal. Off the left rim and out. Well, he finds some space in that in-between gap there. Too bad he can't release that one on target. That bucket in in no time James. at all. I mean, again, LeBron James has been doing this for so long, knocking down that mid-range jumper. Kings leading now by three. Stolen away. Here's Harris. Count the basket and the foul. That one is on heel. Changing ends quickly. He's rewarded with a high percentage look. Yeah, the defense trying to do their best to slow him down, but when he gets room like that, you got to look out. What do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Kings? And they haven't been pushed around in the paint at all in this game. They have been the aggressors. The other impressive part about their offense tonight has been their ability to get inside off the bounce. Lots of points in there. Down low. Here's Heald. That falls. Nice speed that time from Halliburton. Halliburton's got 10 assists here tonight. So active. Guys, some great passing from him. Yeah, everybody's touching it, and you're starting to see the assists pile up because the rhythm is on display offensively. Misses from short range. We're about two minutes into the fourth quarter in this one. Young from outside. He can't get that one to fall. It's been a struggle all night long from deep, but doesn't seem like he's lost his confidence. He's still letting them rip. Halliburton finds Mitchell. Holmes passes to Mitchell. Here's Medu, defended by Young. Four on the clock. It's blocked, and so it looks like the Kings will retain possession here. And some changes here for the Kings. Harrison Barnes comes in for heel, and it's Fox in for Mitchell. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Thanks. That one stings there. Hurts so much more to turn the ball over, especially with how tight the game is. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. Smooth passes to Young. Out of bounds, Sacramento takes possession. Thompson, he's checked in for Sacramento. Into the lineup for your Kings. Tristan The Kings leading. 
For those just joining us, fourth quarter here, we're just over two and a half minutes into it. Fox, they get it back. Thompson with the bucket. Tristan. And one of the stories of the second half has been all of those second chance points. I mean, they have been terrific on the offensive backboard. LeBron James, here's the report, Kevin. Still athletic. And it's Sacramento's ball. Bounce pass, Halliburton. Fox against Curry. Hole. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That's his fourth. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Both free throws, good from home. And if they continue, Kevin, their outstanding free throw shooting, that'll help them seal the deal. The kick out to Young. Driving inside. Ooh. Oh! Ow. Fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. A look at the clock, a little under three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Pass to Holmes. It's not going to go for him. Good defensive work there by Young. It's Curry with the drive and foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That's his first going to go on Tristan Thompson. Second team. How quick was that Curry drive there? Did he having no choice but to body him up to make the effort to throw him off, but they end up fouling him. Sacramento making a switch here. Bagley's checked in. And it's Fox with the ball for the King. They lead by one. And it's denied. Young in the corner, inside, smooth, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. If you came to watch a scoring battle, you're in the right place. Yeah, both of these teams locked in on the offensive end. Going to be a high-scoring affair tonight. Now a timeout called by Sacramento. Reeves and Champ really having a great game. And they simply have no answer right now for what he's doing to them. He is making them pay. And now we present our New Balance player of the game, Champ. And what an amazing ball game we've seen from him. It's been a one-man show worth the price of admission all by itself. There wasn't anything he couldn't do on that court tonight. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Hey, Kevin. Well, look, here's what Alvin Gentry told his team during the break. He said, we're too concerned with their shooters right now. We've got to close off the inside. Two minutes, they are two gutting minutes. us. Two minutes. Lead it with his guys. Come on, let's take a stand. Kevin? Thank you, David. He creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Here's Smooth. Banked in off the glass. Smooth's got four points in the quarter. Just creating havoc for the opponents the last few games. You saw by that putback there, he's just completely locked in. They're getting full contributions from him right now. And he elevates the slam. Thompson did not like that. Here he comes, and there he goes. Oh, look at him punish that rim. 129 left in the game. Fox with it. He's picked up by James. Here's Smooth. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. And that's now 30 points for Smooth. The Kings trail by seven. Now Fox. Shot to stop the run. And it's good on the way in. Fox has got 29. Uh, De'Aaron Fox stepping up for the team, showing he's capable in these moments. The kick out to Young over Barnes. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. And that's now 37 points for Champ. And uh, kind of par for the course here, right? Coming through with a solid offensive game to help them get this lead. Fox, no good. Well, they shouldn't be giving that shot to anyone, but they certainly shouldn't be giving it to him. That's a big break for the defense. The kick out to Young from outside the arc. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Young. King's ball. 35 seconds left in the fourth quarter. 
Here's Fox. The kick out to Barnes. For the three. The rebound by Young. And they can just let the clock run out here. Cannot argue with the W. Number 23. And he sure can get off the floor. He one of the best in the business, absolutely. Guys, let's just go ahead and call this one. It's over. You want to keep expending energy, or do you want to start thinking about the next one? To the middle. It's tipped. From downtown. No good on that one. And so the road team gets the W in this one. They came in here and took care of business like they were the home team. And, Kevin, how about the mental toughness that this group showed? They, they were never yes. rattled at all by the opposing fans. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, LeBron. In the fourth quarter, were you looking to be aggressive? Yeah, I just try to close the game out. You know, my teammates look for me in the fourth quarter to close the game out with my scoring and just my playmaking ability. So, uh, you know, to be able to go out there and come through for it means a lot. I know they're used to it by now, but I know you're still happy with the win. Congrats. Back to you. David, thank you as always. And that about wraps it up. For Brent Berry, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. See you later. Do that and also to uh, make sure you buy skill boost for your player because skill boost really helps you to be able to shoot consistently and just, you know, be all around and just be able to make yourself better to, um, you know, increase your chances for a win. Also, too, if you hit level 40, you could be able to talk to this guy and um, you will be able to get this right here. That's pretty cool on the gym rat badge. And the gym rat badge really gives you um, a plus four to everything. And it also gives you a free extra Gatorade stamina bar where, um, you know, it helps your guy to be faster on the court and different things like that. Have you seen that more people are following you now that you have a logo? Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> um, the crowd gets crazy sometimes. And, um, you know, I appreciate everybody that come out here and support. Wow. <laughs> All right, and this is your first game in season four, so it's right here on 2K TV, so I want to see that dub. Nope, let's go, okay. Ah. Welcome to 2K Sports. We've got live NBA basketball headed your way on this fine Wednesday afternoon. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill, and the fourth member of our crew, reporter Ali LaForce. It was textbook rim protection in that game, taking real pride in shutting down the other team. It was obvious. They pressured that team from the outset every trip down the floor. That will wear an opponent down over time. Now the starting group for the visitors. We've got LeBron James, Joe Harris out there with Stephen Curry, and it's smooth in at the four. Good on the bucket. And some new faces in new places this year, Grant. How long do you think it takes for a new player to fit in? Well, you know, some players never fit in, but depending upon the style, it varies from player to player. And so it looks like it'll be Houston's ball. Rockets ball. Curry against Porter. Pass to Matthews. Cash. Assisting on the play was Porter. As pretty much any coach, that's how he'd like to start the game. Here's Young. 
And the rebound goes to the Rockets. Porter in the post. He's covered by Curry. Porter's shot is off. And we're about a minute into the first. Here's Young. Wood grabs the board. Young's gone one of three shooting so far. The drive by Porter. Oh, ripped away. Here's Smooth. Green covering. Oh! 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 It's incredible to me how remarkably in tune LeBron is with the movement of his teammates. The guy is a scorer, he's a creator, he's a force to be reckoned with. And that replay courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Oh, it's stolen away. Here's Smooth. Rips down the breakaway slam. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. At the end of the day, though, it's two points. Don't hang your heads. Let's get refocused and play with more patience. Now here's Porter. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. You know, he's just leaning a little bit. You try to get away with it, but boy, the official all over it. And a chance there to look back at the stunning mobile one block a moment ago. That'll put some fear into the shooters, and he made sure to do it early, too. Here's Young. Outside Curry. Another shot. And the sweet roll that time on the rim. That one falls. Well, wow. How about that fantastic look by Steph Curry? The ability to create and make the guys around him better. It is incredible to think how Stephen Curry can make something out of nothing. Broken plays, any breakdown, you need a bailout shot. This guy gets better when there is chaos. You know, you have to recognize the chance to push it, and they did. Great pass to get the ball behind the defense and an easy two points on the board. Porter against Curry. Green, the pass to Wood. Over James. Oh, and just miss after miss right now. So often, Doris, we've seen Curry almost lose the ball, then pull off something. Oh, okay then. They've played with fantastic energy from the opening tip. Well, you set the tempo early, and when you get command and control of a game, it's perfect. Timeout called. Houston. They're looking to do something to stop this run. They have to get back on track. Really needs to settle his guys down right now and get them refocused. Young's gone 50% from the field. Three out of six. James against Wood. The nine-footers on the mark. Defensively, that's not a good one-on-one -on -one matchup. Too much height to give away. Pass to Smooth. Out to the wing. Here's Young. They grab their own miss. Goes back up. Will not go. Misses off the front iron. He hasn't helped the cause with his shooting, but his teammates have had his back. Just under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the first quarter. Wood. Here's Horford. Outside for Porter. Three-pointer. He buries it from three. Al Horford is such a tremendous passer as a big man. Wow, does he get work done offensively. 17-foot shot on the way. Young with the bucket. Young's got eight points. What a terrific play by just a tremendous all-around player. This guy makes it look easy. Here's Porter going inside. Wood tips it back in. Real smooth, guys. Great job with the tip in. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about a player. Now, here is James. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Here's Green. Pass to Matthews. Wood with it. Checked by James. Wood misses. Boy, surprised he missed that. The defense just good enough to prevent that bucket. Young misses. 
he didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. And they turn it over. Stepped on the line that time. All right, the Rockets making a switch here. Tate's checked in. Coming out of the floor for your Rockets. Jay Sean Tate. And we've got 118 left in the first quarter. Here's Smooth. Horford with the block. Well, this guy is a consistent shot block threat. Now Horford twice on the pipes. Here's Young. And he drops in the layup off the glass. He's got 10. He's putting on a show this quarter, and the team's feeding off his energy. Pass to Tate. Green against Young. Green, the pass to Porter. Over James. Porter shot is off. Boy, a tough go for him in this quarter. You can see how desperately he wants to get things started. He just can't make a shot. <laughs> Good defensive intensity, but you have to stay in control always. And he hits the first of three. Shooting for the away team. At the line for three. Good on the second one. And he nails the third. He's one of the league's best free throw shooting bigs. A performance like this certainly proves it. Here's Green. And it's hammered home by Green. A strong finish to cut into that lead a little. Man, left no doubt with that one, Grant. There's Young with the three. He gets rebounded by Houston. Horford's got four rebounds now. Here's Porter. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's his first personal foul. That free throw, no good. Kevin Porter Jr. And the second free throw is good. And here's Curry. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. From nine feet out. And Young the assist bucket on the assist by Harris. Harris. Well, they're leading in large part because of the work he's put in in this quarter. This is nicely done. And they call an illegal screen here. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. It is really difficult to get your feet completely set, to stay completely still. It's almost surprising to me that it isn't called more often. Here's Young. What a play! He drains it at the buzzer! And credit him for understanding the situation and coming through. And to me, the way you end quarters impacts how you end the game. It can go a long way between a W or an L. And as we conclude the first quarter, a one-sided game so far. They lead by 13. Let's take a quick... And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. And what do you guys think about the visitors here in this one? Oh, what I love was that first quarter was all about leaking out and capitalizing in transition. Man, why wouldn't they? You see their effectiveness in the open floor. Very difficult to slow down. We've got Joe Harris. Stephen Curry is out there with LeBron James. And it's smooth in at the four. Chalk up two there. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. And looking at the career of Curry, his legacy is set. The titles, records, numbers all cemented him as a legend. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. Where was the defense? No help. You can't afford to give up these kinds of buckets. And from the sideline, let's catch up with Allie. Hey, B.A., after the departure of their head coach and president of basketball ops last season, the Rockets traded away star James Harden. Now, he and many of their vets were sent to rivals of the 76ers. Why is that relevant? Well, their former president is now running things in Philly. Brian, perhaps it's business and personal in Houston. Well, that's a good point, Allie. Thanks for that. And Young gets it to go. At times, some have doubted Curry's legacy. 
Hard to make a case against him, though, in my opinion. <laughs> I agree, B.A. He has produced in every capacity. It's just a matter of how great he is. One of the top three point guards of all time. Here's Smooth. Sinks the tray. 11 points in the game. Well, this guy flat out carrying the load for them offensively. He is taking and making good shots. What a terrific job. With the mark. And he's going oh, to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. First team. As a rookie of the year award winner yourself, Grant, what do you see as the biggest challenge facing today's role? I honestly think with all the information and expectations, the hardest thing for young players today is meeting those expectations because of all the great rookies who've come before and gone on and had success right away. Number that pressure a lot of times can be a lot for a young player entering the league. This guy is putting on a clinic for the people. Man, I'm shocked. I can't believe he pulled that off in a real game. Gordon against Young. And he stepped on the line, so they turn it over. One of those nights where the wheels come off, nerves seem to be playing a factor. From deep. Can't get it to drop. And Houston will come the other way. Right now trying to get into a rhythm, but so far this quarter, boy, he is struggling to make anything go down. Takes it inside, and Young slams it in. Hanging on the rim, just showing off. <laughs> That's how you extend the glory right there. And the Rockets with possession here. And that's two oh, fouls for him foul. so far. But I still think that's he needs to stay aggressive. Foul. Second team foul. Oh. Let's go. And here in the second quarter of action, just a hair under two and a half minutes played. Rejected by James. Don't bring that weak stuff in here. LeBron always on the prowl to send shots back with force. Pass to Smooth. Porter pulls it in. And here's Houston. Here's the floater. And it's Harris with the rebound. Here's Smooth. That is now his seventh field goal in ten attempts. Impressive. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Gordon on the wing, guarded by Young. Here's Gordon. Five to shoot. Unloads from 13. And another miss by Houston. I'll tell you, you hate to pin this on one person, but his inefficiencies at the offensive end are holding this group back. Count that bucket. Young's got 23. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. Now, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for, consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense oh, once again. Foul. Number 23. That's his first personal foul. He's off on the first. Woods checked in for the Rockets. Line for Houston. And he sinks the second. And give them credit for making a more concerted effort to get to the line this quarter. James against Wood. And it's James with the jam. And they're really rolling right now. That lead keeps getting bigger and bigger. And one of the things that's helped that is they're getting it done on both ends. Terrific focus on offense, and they're locked in defensively. And the Rockets call time here. And the longevity of LeBron's greatness is unprecedented. The oldest starter in the league last season and still producing at an MVP level. Make some noise. Rockets making a switch here. Green is checked in. Jalen Green. Wood passes to Tatum. Young with the double team. Porter against Harris. Pass to Wood. Rebounded by LeBron. 
And what's incredible for LeBron is not just how good he is at his age, but the mileage on his body, Grant. So true, B.A. I mean, just three players in NBA history have exceeded 60,000 minutes played, including the playoffs. That's Kareem, Carl Malone, and the one and only LeBron James. Now Green. 125 left in the second period. Uses the glass to finish the layup. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. Green's gone two of three from the floor. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. That's his third personal foul. That's ten straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Horford, he's checked in for Gordon. LeBron James. One shot. That free throw, good from James. Well, how about a multi-time champion and a multi-time MVP? And LeBron James continues to dominate. It truly is special to watch. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. And Young slams it in. In terms of offense, they've been the more efficient team by far. And I think because of that, they've gotten the better looks to start this basketball game. To the paint. Rejected by James. And they recover it. Porter, the pass to Horford. Green against Young. And it's hammered home by Green. There you go. He's a monster at the rim. So athletic. Obviously, he plays on the attack. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And then Porter with the dunk. Transition basketball. The most reliable way to generate easy looks. The very definition of quality transition offense. If it can end at the cup, it's exactly where you want it. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. Here's Young. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot and will go to the line. At the line for the away team. Shooting one. Free throw is good. Young. There's 10 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Green for three. The shot comes out. And so a pretty lopsided game through the first half. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey again, everybody. So far, a pretty uh, lopsided game, but still one half to play. I'm Ernie Johnson, joined by Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. Checking out the visiting team. Kenny, how'd you see it? They're going right to the rim, finishing every chance they get. The D was helpless trying to stop them and beating them inside. I love the relentlessness and the aggressive style. This is how you impose your will on another team. And Shaq, let's get your input on the Rockets. Well, their sloppy play really surprised me, especially the turnovers. No matter who they had out there, they never seemed to be on the same page. Their only hope is to make every possession count. And that'll about do it as we get... And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Here's Curry. Porter Jr. and Green team up in the backcourt. Christian Wood out there with Al Horford. And it's Matthews in at the three slot. So that's who's on the floor for the Rockets. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Horford, left side. And then Porter with the dunk. Getting up and then throwing it down. Oh, that was a big hammer right there. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. Oh, my, oh, my. And that was textbook defense. Positioning himself well to send it back. 
Here's Green. James with the rebound. James has got a rebound number five here tonight. Here's Smooth. Boom! He jams it straight down. We so often identify Joe Harris. Joe Harris as strictly a shooter, but this guy, he is a tremendous passer as well. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Hey, Brian. When speaking about LeBron James, Commissioner Adam Silver said he's certainly one of the league's hardest workers, which has as much to do with the success of his career as anything else. Also, off the court, it's incredible what he's done. He is a marvel in so many ways, but it all comes back to his focus and his dedication. Thanks, Allie. And you get some traditional big man stuff from Wood. If you look at his handles going one-on-one -on -one outside the painted area, most centers can't do all the things that he can do. It's stolen by James. Here's the break. He goes up. And that one is hammered home. I'll tell you, if LeBron never scored a point, he'd still be valuable to an offense. How good a pass is that? When you're casual with the ball, it can come back to bite you. Yeah, B.A., playing loose can help you and hurt you. They really need to tighten it up. Wood misses, and Wood's shown great versatility on offense. But the same skill set applies on the defensive end as well. I mean, he can switch. He slides on the perimeter to protect the rim. His skill set is exactly what scouts are looking for now at the center position. Stepped on the line. Out of bounds there. And that will cost him a possession. Substitution for your Rockets, Josh Christopher. Right side, Young. Shoots from the baseline. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. Young's got six here in the quarter. And you know Coach loves seeing his offense operate at this level. Great passing out there. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. James. Curry gets the bucket. Curry. Curry's gotten his second bucket. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? Here's Christopher. He's covered by Curry. And Young with the block. To the inside. Here's Smooth. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. 21 points in the game. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. Here's Christopher. He's covered by Curry. Out to Horford. Four on the clock. Here's Shangun. Drops in the layup for two. Another shot right in the lane. That's been their M.O. this evening. Outside Young. Driving in. And then Young slams it in. Now, I know he makes it look easy, but it takes incredible physical tools to pull that off. Athleticism and explosion. Green against Young. Green in the post. He has six. Young with the defensive effort. And then Young slams it in. And since the halftime break, their offense has just been on another level. I gotta believe that's something the Two coach minutes talked minutes to them about at the halftime. They have valued each possession. Ooh, had a nice open look right there. Green's got nine points. I'll tell you, you are playing with fire anytime you leave this guy open, and they just got burned. Lays out, and out of bounds. Houston will have it. Tate's checked in for the Rockets. Gordon comes in for Green. Substitution for your Rockets. Jay Sean Tate. 144 left in the third quarter. Now Gordon. And there's the drive. Count it. Bad idea leaving him open. He needs more defensive attention, not less. Gordon's gone two for three from the field. Here's Smooth. Here's James. Young from long range. A one team foul. Number 23. Let's take another That's look at the staunch defense foul. during that mobile one block. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. 1-11 left in the third quarter. Pass to Christopher. 
Let's go with a three. Another three from Houston. Boy, major defensive laps on that trip, leaving him all alone in three-point territory, and he drills it. And slam dunk by James. Uh, the elevation and athleticism of LeBron at his size, just incredible. Stolen by Young, and they're on the run. And that one's good. Young's got 44. And just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. Oh, that's oh. something else, I mean, just man. Beautiful. Just rising up to the rim. Man, when he gets up there, he gets up there. You know what I'm saying? Man, they've been careless with the ball tonight. Yes, yeah, a lack of focus and a lack of discipline. Oh, wait, They're better foul. than this. That's his third personal foul. First team foul. Substitution for your Rockets. Christian and Wood. we've got 28 seconds Kevin left in the Jr. third quarter. Wood passes to Tatum. Wood with it. Gordon on the wing. Down to five on the shot clock. Over Young. Gordon can't hit. Boy, a clean, close look. What a missed opportunity. Young on the attack. And they pick up two. Young's got 16 points here in the second half. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly, and capitalizing. And as we conclude the third, pretty much a blowout here. It's been a one-sided affair. Delivering the blowout. And when we return, we'll get the fourth quarter rolling here on 2K Sports. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. And here are the Rockets. They've got Stephen Curry. Joe Harris out there with LeBron James. And it's Young in at the two. Wood against James. James with the block. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by James. Coming out of the floor for your Rockets. David Nwaba. Gordon on the wing. Shot clock at six. Outside Nwaba. There's the three. Smooth grabs the miss. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Here's Young. Yet another bucket. <laughs> My goodness. 50 for the game. Just putting on a show. I think you simply have to admire the way Stephen Curry distributes the basketball. His vision, his court awareness is simply insane. Here's Gordon. And Gordon with the big finish. Basic one-hander there. Hey, I think he got some extra bounce off the ground on that one. Outside Young. Over Nwaba. Another one goes. Incredible. <laughs> That's 52 points for him. Making it all look too easy right now. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Augustine can't get it to go. Here's Young. There's the oh, wow. He's a living highlight reel. Seriously, that could end up being one of the best dunks of the year. Outside Augustine. This is exactly what you expect from DJ Augustine. This is why coaching staffs love him. He makes everyone better. Here's Young. Yes, it's good. Young's got 56 in the game. Stephen These defenders Curry. really need to man up, particularly in the lane. Out left to the wing. Back to Gordon. And we're about two minutes into the fourth now. That one falls. Augustine's got his first points of the game. Really impressive from DJ Augustine right there. This guy is so smart and figures out ways to score. And again. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. B.A., it feels like he can't miss. And it's the Rockets with the ball. Well, super teams are still being built. 
Grant, what's the key to making it work with three or four guys who all need touches? Well, it comes down to good communication between your leaders. Of course, you have to have a plan. You can't be out there winging it. And of course, prioritizing wins over stats always works. Here's Young. And it's good. He hits another one. 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. Gordon against Harris. Gordon down low, and he converts the layup. I'll tell you, individually, he is doing all he can. But right now, somebody's got to step in and support this guy. James finds Curry. Here's Young. Yet another assist. That makes 15 assists. He has been one step ahead of the defense all game long. And it's Augustine off the drive. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Rockets will retain possession. Rockets ball. Substitution for your Rockets. Daniel Tice. Josh Christopher. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. Pass to Augustine. Four on the clock. Pulls up. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. This has not been his best quarter. And you know what? They keep calling his number, and they're simply trying to get him out of this funk. There's Young with the three. And they'll get another chance. Over Tice. Young can't hit. You got to move past that one. I mean, they'd want him to take that again. And they should, because it's when you start turning down Two that kind minutes. of look that your David offense can start to bog down a bit. Minutes. David Nwaba. Now here's Curry. Unloads. Offensive board. Chains right side. Pass to Young. Takes a three. On target three. from range. Now, you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to him at all times. Well, you know this. This is a guy who's looking for his shot the whole time. You have to know who you're guarding. KYP, know your personnel. A minute and a half left in the fourth quarter. Assisted that falls. Joe nice Harris. set up by Harris. And trying to put the game away, he's been nails all evening. And he hasn't forced much tonight. I love the efficiency he's giving to them. Pass to Tice. Clock at six. Now Augustine lets it go from deep. And Young pulls it down. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. And here are the Rockets now. 51 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Well, not exactly one of those big, burly power forwards, right? He depends on his leaping ability more than those guys, and it serves him just fine. Curry's shot is off. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. Here's Christopher, guarded by Young. Oh, nice shot by Nwaba. Well, they needed this run way earlier. At some point, it's too little, too late. Yeah, but then again, this run came against a team that may have felt it had already won, and you get the sense it let its guard down. Well, he's been shooting it so well because he's been so active, moving and working to get high percentage shots. At the line for one. Free throw is good. Young. And the Rockets with possession here. About three seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. And that's a foul. Called on Stephen Curry. That's his first foul of the game. First team foul. Twenty-three seconds left in the final quarter. Now here's Augustine. The D's right on him. LeBron with the rebound. Outside Curry. Let's it go. 
Hits yet again. Wow. What a game from him. 72 points. And he's been simply sensational throughout this one. And so it's a victory for the road team in this one. To walk into enemy territory and deliver a performance like that, that says a lot about this squad. They really came in looking confident and didn't let anything shake them. This is what a dominant team looks like. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Steph, I know it's still early, but how do you evaluate this team and its ability to go the distance? Uh, in terms of communicating about our principles and how we're going to be successful, trying to chase another championship, we're definitely uh, on the same page. Just a matter of staying focused every night, giving the best effort we can, and just you know enjoying the journey because it's a long year. Well, you've been there. You know what it takes. Thanks, Steph. All right, Allie, thank you. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Doris Burke, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, and all of our crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. We'll see you later.